Yo, what's up, peoples? Roscoe2k1 is here. And this is not exactly a pipe bomb. This is more or less a lesson. You know, the First Amendment has been around since the Constitution, obviously. And what the First Amendment does is it gives us free speech. We're allowed to say whatever we want, no matter what it is. And, I mean, sure, the law's given parameters to it, as in don't be yelling fire in a building that's not even close to on fire <clears throat> when it's occupied by a ton of people and that's for safety and that I understand um, but to control the other things that we say it just doesn't make any sense um, and it's not really the, the law that does it exactly <clears throat> excuse me I know you can be held in contempt of court for saying bad, for using bad language, but here's the thing: hypocritical people in this world who do offensive things and fight for the rights to do the, these things that are that other people seem to consider offensive, that go around and tell people what they can and cannot say or do because they find them offensive to me are hypocritical and wrong. Um, women who breastfeed in public are extremely offensive to some people, including myself. I find, I do, I, I do find a woman who just whips out her boob in public, I, I, it's just offensive to me. It is not gonna kill, it would not kill you to get a breast pump, pump out the milk into a bottle, or a thermos that can keep it warm and feed your baby. That's my opinion. I'm not saying that there should be a law against it. I'm just saying that ladies should be more discreet. But at the same token, or by the same token, these same women, a lot of times, I've noticed... A lot of people, you'll hear these words come out of out of their gullets. You know, watch your mouth. Watch your mouth. Stop that cursing. You know, I got that from my parents a lot. To be honest, my language is toned down a lot since I was a kid, little teenager, little young adult. It has. Um. But what I'm trying to figure out is why these words, like, fuck. Damn, well not damn, because damn is actually a curse word. But fuck, ass, bitch, you know, dick, you know, even even cunt. It's a bad word because of the connotation, I believe. Women find it extremely offensive, and I don't really like it. <clears throat> Been saying it a lot lately. But that's neither here nor there thing is, is people want us to watch our language. Because why? Because it offends them. Now, I'm not saying that I'm going to teach Haley to just walk around, walking up to a teacher going, excuse me, that little boy over there is fucking with me. Or, um, teacher, I have to take a shit. You know, I'm not going to teach her that. But, what I will teach her is, that there are only two curse words, damn and goddamn, and that the other words that are supposedly curse words are just, they're slang words. People just find them to be offensive. And <clears throat> in the spirit of decency, you shouldn't say those words around everyone. You're around your friends, I don't care. I mean, when she's old enough to be able to use those words without... Without their friends going and being like, Mommy, Haley said shit. And the mom calling me. Your daughter said shit to my fucking kid. That's when I'd be on the phone going, Really? So the word shit is that much of a shock to him? And your swearing is an everyday occurrence. You will hear it unless you are a hermit in your house who does not watch television, look at, look, watch the internet at all, listen to music at all, or are deaf. And shit, there's even curse words for deaf people. You know? That means fuck you. <sighs> curse words are unavoidable. Bad language is unavoidable. 
and, and to be honest with you, I'm not a, I'm not as offended by people who use um, what people consider swear words as much as I'm offended by people who can't, who have been in this in America for their entire lives and still speak crappy English. That offends me. But again, that's neither here nor there. The point of this is simply just to say, and I wasn't picking on women who breastfeed in public. Um, there are other things as well. I just find that that's the most relevant topic to me at the moment. The point is, ladies and gentlemen, is that if you're going to sit there and say that one thing is offensive and do something else that's offensive, then your priorities are screwed up. And, and as well as, if you're going to say that I can't say a particular word, then you can go fuck yourself because until they decide to change that in the Constitution, in that First Amendment, I can say whatever I want. I can walk to anybody and call them anything I want. That doesn't, ex- that, I mean, I, hey, if I take an ass whooping for it, then I'm probably sure that I well deserve that ass whooping. And that's not the point. It's not the point, though. Point is, what people consider to be curse words are not curse words. But in the spirit of decency, because a decent human being does not want to offend. A decent person wants to be as polite and as calm as they can possibly be. And keep things as calm as they can. And so they just use normal words. It isn't about being decent, it isn't about being fair, it's about being a person and being considerate. That's why I don't walk around cursing all the time, because I'm being considerate. And women who breastfeed in public, um, guys who go to the beach wearing those ugly ass speedos, okay, those, those actions are offensive to some people. And... You might not want to do them. And the thing is, too, if you're going to look at me and say, well, I'm going to feed my, I'm going to breastfeed my baby in public all I want. What are you going to do to stop me? Then I'm going to look at you and say, okay, bitch, I'm going to say the word fuck. All I fucking want in fucking public. What the fuck are you going to do about it? If you have the right to breastfeed in public and you choose to exercise that right, well, why the hell? Can I not exercise my right to say fuck as much as I want to in public? Because, hey, it is my right. So, hey, that's been, this has been another fun time with Roscoe2001. I'm pretty sure I've offended every single person watching this video. But, I love you guys, though. Go fuck yourselves.